so kama niko dipotio acha niko kwanza kupanda ndege kwenda Canada yeye ni relax na miguu na miguu na huko we are all africans and african timers per se Kenyans have been labeled most of the times as the last minute nation and today they lived up to the word by filling various huduma center registration stations in the country in a bid to beat tomorrow's deadline the message they have for the government of the day is all clear leo umefika hapa saa ngapi leo nimefika hapa saa 12 nipanga line mpaka saa hizi na sioni matumaini ya kupata hii namba so unaona vipi leo so naona nirudi nienda nilale ni ngoja serikali kama watanidipota ama watanifanyia nini jua hata wajetueleza hii namba unachukua kufanyia nini eh unaweza kuwa unachukua na uelewe kitu inakusaidia so kama niko dipotio acha niko kwanza kupanda ndege kwenda Canada yeye ni relax na miguu na miguu na huko kila siku nchi inatumia takriban shilingi milioni ya msini mm. kwa hili zoezi mm. kwa hivyo kumaanisha wakiongeza kama ni siku ulizosema 30 hiyo ni 30 times uh, 50 million ambayo inakuja karibu 1.5 billion hiyo ni pesa kidogo kwa serikali bwana mm hiyo -hmm. ni pesa kidogo sana hiyo ni pesa wanapata na siku moja mm -hmm. uh, so watu, watu watumie pesa uh, watu wasaidiwa wapate kazi ya kuandikisha watu ndio wapate pesa mm -hmm. lakini una hisi vipi huduma namba inatufaa kama wa Kenya tunahitaji sasa hivi ama vipi imeingia sana ndani kwa sababu niliona form nilisoma katika ile form yao wameingia ndani sana ya maisha ya mwananchi wa kawaida eh? inakupekua mm -hmm. inakuweka kwa kichungi kabisa sasa sijui nini nini Kenya wanaangalia kina kaubaka ndani ya mwananchi wa kawaida ni jambo gani ambalo walikufurahisha ambalo walitaka kujua labda sasa unapata wanakuuliza uko na shamba uko na shamba ekari ngapi ni yako ama ni ya community ama ni ya nini sasa hiyo ndio nashangaa mbona wanaenda kindani ndani mbona wanataka kunijua mimi zaidi kila mtu alikuwa amechukulia hiyo huduma namba kama job but then now you can a place that like you have to do it like so that you can access uh, vitu za serikali most kenyans are being referred to by other people as a last minute nation What are your thoughts on this? Mm, I think that this is just Kenya and everyone is always like that. So they first they always check the some staff from the government as a job. So that's why now it's rushing. Kuna jida hapa kwa sababu tangu nikuja hapa sabiri. Kwa hiyo nimekuwa mrefu hata baada hatujafanikiwa kwa sababu forms pia tu wengine walikuwa wamepata wanajaza ndio wanangojea kwa line. Lakini wengine bado hawajapata. Sasa kile ningeomba tu serikali jaribu kuongeza muda kwa sababu hata kama wamesema ni kesho lakini naona hii idadi kubwa ya watu bado haijashika lakini asua tukiangazia hii wiki hakujakuwa na line ndefu kama leo mbona umengoja siku ya mwisho unajua wakati mwingine wengine walikuwa nakosa nafasi wakasema wacha watu waendelee labda wakati wa mwisho tutapata kama watu wengine wameshika harafu imerudi chini mm. hatukuwa tunajua itakuja ongezeka kumbe kila mtu alikuwa anangoja sasa tumekutana hapa hivi mm. for how long have you been at the queue as at now and uh, at what time do you expect to be served today I think I'm going to be served tomorrow because the queue is very long and actually I've lost hope but I just have to say but I haven't stayed at the queue for a long time I just came now Basically why didn't you opt to have it maybe before the deadline which is Okay I was out of the country so I came back and I found the the stories about the huduma number so I had to take it mm -hmm. yeah. All right Kenyans have often been accused of being a last minute people mm -hmm. What's your view on this Yeah it's true Kenyans rush at the last minute that that is being a Kenyan if you don't rush at the last minute you're not considered as a Kenyan so it is a, it's a trend Do you have your Duma number? I took it uh, a month ago. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And I took it when there were no people, there were no lines. I was indeed alone mm -hmm. when I was doing it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Why did you opt for being the early bird? Uh, first of all, I'm a, I'm a preacher. And I like doing things which will help the government to resolve the many problems we have economic so social and uh, the many other types of problems we have you've had these jitters that uh, this huduma number is sort of satanic from kenyans and everything what's your view on this that is from uh, negative theology it's about people who have uh, the ulterior motive people who do not want say to pay their taxes and uh, the churches are known now to be evading taxes mm -hmm. so they are preaching against it, against it so that they can have opportunity to 
to have a leeway. Do you think the government should give an extension? Fairly, out of uh, <laughs> out of um, the mercy of the government, and uh, because we are working out of lack of knowledge, let the government uh, ex give an extension. Exactly. Mm. Fine, last minute. last minute. Like, kama kuna exercise kama hii alafu hiyo time ikisha kama mtu hajahudumiwa wanafaa kupenalizwa si ni watu ndo ya wanafaa kupenalizwa tu ndo wajifunze kufanya vitu mapema eh 